What is good, Gray Gang? We're out here today. We're about to go coyote hunting, but first we're sighting in our guns a little bit. Ethan's gonna be taking his 224, just a little overview of it. We've done a video over it on the gun channel, but it's a 224 Valkyrie, super weird looking round. Giant KG Jaeger Pro Scope on it. Really cool looking compensator, and here's the bullet itself. It's one of the best long range bullets you can get. But that is what Ethan's taking. I'm actually gonna take this shotgun right here. And the weird thing about these coyotes, we've already, we already know the coyotes we're looking for. They are a nuisance, okay? They've been eating some property, but it's not like they're killing cows. They're eating a man's Corn. Ain't that right? Yeah. It, it really don't make sense. But we're just gonna go with it, okay? Alright, send them down anytime. Alright, let's go check it out. Okay, that's looking okay. Well, we didn't hit it. Oh, we did. You only hit one. Anyways, he was aiming right here at the top of the house. We're gonna move it up a lot and to the left a lot, and then we're gonna see where we hit. Get done. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, where's your tread at? This man's out really out here drifting a mule. Alright, Ethan, let's fire the next few shots. I won't go ahead and adjust to that hole. I don't know how you shot twice and only hit, hit the whole target once. I don't know. We should be close right there. I'm going to try that silhouette one when we go, just see if we're close. In the meantime, while Ethan's trying to sight in his scope, I'm going to use this, and I don't have to sight it in at all. There you go. Put two, see if we can hit that silhouette down there. I think we will. Are you going to go straight for the silhouette? Yeah. One hit it. How many bullets you got? I got a whole box. Oh, okay, we're good then. Uh, is it recording? Is it? I don't know. Is that the red thing? Yeah. All right, all right, we're good. Anyways, guys, we're heading out now. We're uh, we're going after these corn-eating coyotes. We gotta be careful. We've never seen coyotes eat but corn before, and because of that, we don't know the, what they truly are ready. We don't know. What am I even saying? I don't know. I don't even know where you're going. What I'm trying to say is I, these could be poisonous. Maybe it's a mix of the crow. I don't know. One way or another, it's going to be interesting, okay? we don't, Neither one of us has any camouflage at all. He ain't even wearing pants. We have a call. It's like seven. Kendall's driving experience is like a four of ten. Just to let you guys know. Why is that? The guy will run anything over. I've learned that riding with him. What? If it's in the road, you'll run it over. Well, I mean... If, if a truck isn't made to run over a stick, then what is, is it even a truck? If the mule can't drive over a log, does it deserve to be driven? But long story short, guys, we're heading up there. We're just gonna try our best and hopefully we kill something. Don't know what, but we'll kill something. Maybe. Time. Okay, okay, okay. We're in the location now. We do have a little background noise, okay? We got, we got an eight-year-old going crazy on a four-wheeler, doing wheelies and everything. The whole six yards. We have a highway right there. Don't worry, we're far enough away from it. And this is our shooting lane. That's not a public road. Don't even get me started. But we're gonna set the call right down there in that field. Okay, I'll wait. We're gonna set the call right down there in that valley and hopefully we can bring them out of the mountain, bring them out from over here, bring them, I don't know, over here somewhere. All right, guys, here we go. We got the thing. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. There it is. It's right out there spinning. It's got the little decoy on it. We're gonna start off with some kind of rabbit distress. And now, we just sit here and wait for something to happen. Absolute stealth sniper. Can't even see him. Oh, he moved. All right, guys, so far we have got some attention. It appears to be the neighbor's dogs have located our call. They are currently signaling back with the multiple howls and a couple barks. A lot of you guys may be saying I'm too loud, but listen, I, we got a lot of cover sound, okay? We got a girl on a four-wheeler. Uh, here comes here comes a dog. It's our own dog. What is he doing? Go back home. Go. But yeah, I can talk. Huh? There's a key up. Here comes a Kia. I think he's keyed in on her sound. But yeah, guys, we got quite a bit of cover sound, so me talking a little bit ain't gonna make a difference. He's gonna go ahead and build his ghillie suit. As for me, I'm just chilling here. I think we're doing pretty good. I think next time we will come back with camouflage, but uh, this is just the first time to gauge the situation. I mean, these coyotes were eating corn, so it shouldn't be that hard to kill. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I think the chrome barrel might actually help us stay concealed. <laughs> okay, so far, so far the hunt's not, not really doing super awesome. Not at all. I thought we were supposed to be in the middle of nowhere. Okay, we're leaving. All right, guys, we're heading on to spot number two. We really don't know what to expect here. We don't have corn-eating coyotes, but, but there's also coyotes everywhere, and I've actually never killed one. Oh, 
ta 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 ta.